Good morning, everyone. This is Friday, November the 4th. I'm Brandi Cummings. Here is a look at the top stories we're following today. The Yolo County Elections Office will begin processing and counting vote by mail ballots starting at 1 this afternoon. This process is open to the public. The Elections Office is encouraging anyone to email them if you're interested in observing. The results, though, won't be posted until after 8 o'clock on Tuesday, which, of course, is Election Day. You can get a ride to a ballot drop box or in-person vote center for free on Election Day. Sacramento Regional Transit says it will drive voters to locations across the Sacramento region. All bus routes, light rail, smart ride and SAC RT GO services, among others, that'll all be free. No flyer or exemption code is necessary. Now to plan your ride, visit the SAC RT website. The health insurance portal through Covered California is up and running for its 10th year. State leaders celebrated yesterday for what they call the agency's progress over the years by launching the 10 years strong campaign. In Sacramento alone, about 10,000 people have been directly assisted through Covered California. You can sign up for their health insurance options on Covered California's website. Now, the last day that you can enroll is January 31st. For a check of the forecast, let's head over now to meteorologist Tamara Berg. Hey, you're stepping out that door, noticing that there's just a few more clouds shuffling on down from the north. We'll see some of these clouds around as we head through the day, but today is going to be a dry day, and it's going to be a beautiful day to be outside. Just has that fall feel to it from start to finish. The morning temperatures, again, diving down into the 30s for most of our valley spots. I do expect we'll have some scattered frost for the valley, and then in the foothills, a better chance for more widespread frost to develop through the morning. Into the afternoon, again, sunshine and clouds. Temperatures in the upper 50s are around 1 o'clock. Highest today getting into the lower to mid 60s range. And again, today is a dry day. Brandy. Tamara, thanks so much. And that's a look at what we're following here on KCRA 3 today.